On June 28th, 1969, the cops raided the Stonewall Inn. And although that had happened many times before, on that particular night, folks decided that they weren't going to take it anymore. And they fought back. And the events of that evening set forth a new history, a new movement for LGBTQIA people around this country. And that movement is one that gains momentum today. It's formed community. It's, it's gotten more rights. It's brought new issues to the forefront. But the question remains, who represents that community? Whose stories deserve to be told? The fact of the matter is, there's so many members of that community. There's so many identities that one can have. Gay, lesbian, bisexual, transgender, uh, intersex, asexual, non-binary, pansexual. The list goes on and on. And so there's no one person who can possibly give voice to the entire community. And so we here at Rutgers, in order to celebrate Pride on this 50th anniversary year of Stonewall, have decided to give a few voices the chance to share their stories. Join us this Sunday, the 23rd after church, for a Pride Roundtable Lunch, where we'll get to talk with folks from the lesbian and gay and bisexual and trans and asexual communities to hear what their individual experiences have been like. One voice can't represent an entire community, obviously, but by hearing these individual stories and uplifting them, we'll be able to get a better glimpse of what it means to be a part of the queer community today.